Hi guys, it's Michaela and welcome back to my channel and welcome to a holiday look. I did this very kind of, kind of icy blue, very wintry look that I feel like would be great for the holidays if green and red just aren't your favorite colors. I feel like I really get into icy blues during the holiday season. It is one of my favorite colors. Um, so it's very sparkly, very holiday-esque, very just kind of me but colorful but also I feel like it's wearable. It's bold. But again, it's very wearable, so if you'd like to see how I got this look, just keep on watching. To start, I already primed my eyes with my Ulta Beauty Matte Primer, and I set them with the Urban Decay All Nighter Powder. And I'm going to actually go in with the Nabla Cutie Palette. And to start off, I'm going to go in with the shade Air on a crease brush, and just buff that through my crease until I get the pigment where I want it to. I just, I just kind of want this to peek out through the rest of my makeup and just kind of give it a tr smooth transition. I'm not trying to deepen it up too much, but of course, make it as deep as you would like. And then I'm going to go in with the shade Blue Hour, and I'm going to place that on the outer V. This one's going to take a little bit of building up, and of course, I'll have to go back and forth as I get the eye look. It does take a minute to blend, so if it's not blending hard, as quickly as you'd like just work with it and maybe go back and forth between the deep shade and the crease shade I'm just gonna keep going working on that and going back and forth just buffing around the edges with my first blue shade and of course just slowly building that up when that is where I want it I'm gonna take on my finger the shade Quiet Storm. There's the focus. But I'm going to take it Quiet Storm on my finger just like that and I am going to take this starting on the very edge of that blue and taking it all the way across the lid. And this shade here because it, I don't, it doesn't feel like a pressed glitter but it definitely is very glittery so it does take a little bit of working with. But when you press and swipe, kind of going back and forth, it just adds such a stunning, just glittery effect. And after that, I'm going to take the shade Alma on my finger. You can use a brush if you want. I feel like it can get away with that. But take the shade Alma and then just place that on the very inner corner. And I love the icy blue, almost a violet effect that that gives. And then I'm actually going to go ahead and go off camera, catch the other eye up, come back and do the lower lash line. I'll do my foundation and my concealer, and I'll just shape that outer edge out a little bit using my beauty sponge. Back to do what the lower lash line, a little pro tip. I like to shape my eyeshadow using concealer versus just trying to shape it with a brush. So I'll put my concealer underneath my eye and kind of on the edge of my eyeshadow, and I'll take my beauty sponge and just slowly kind of blend up in tapping motions and then out just to kind of give that eye a little bit shape. I just find it a lot easier than trying to make the brushes work for your eye shape. It's just concealers like makeup's magic eraser I feel like. For the lower lash line I'm going to start in with the Urban Decay 24-7 Glide On Eye Pencil in the shade Sabbath. I went ahead and tight line the top already but I'm going to go ahead and just tight line the bottom waterline. Just, I just want to give my eyeshadow some depth. I feel like this blue pairs really well with the rest of the shadows. And then I'm going to go in with a little liner brush. I'm going to take the shade Blue Hour. And I'm mostly going to focus that on the outer third and just kind of pretty much just setting that eyeliner down and kind of smudging it, working it out. But I'm just going to use most of it on the outer third of my eye and just kind of sweep it in, whatever's left on the brush. And then I'm gonna go back in with the shade Air on just a little fluffy brush and just smoke that lower lash line out a little bit more. And then on the other side of that brush, just using the same brush to kind of marry the colors together, I'm gonna to take the shade Alma and then just bring that down. I'm almost doing the same thing as I did on the upper lash line mine as well that blue shimmer shadow and then I'm gonna go ahead and off camera again I'm gonna do use my Ulta Beauty New Heights mascara 
match the other eye up, finish the rest of my makeup, and I will be back to show you guys the final look. And here is the eye look done. And here is the full face. Here's the outfit as a whole. It's not very holiday-esque, but I wear florals all year round. I have this blue top. I actually got this, I think I got this whole outfit from the thrift store. Then I've got this white coat. It's got some floral overlay right here, so I just thought it would look really well with the look. And with that, thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you're not subscribed already, I would love to have you around. I do videos focusing on beauty and lifestyle, and my goal on this platform is to share my love for beauty as well as my love for Christ as my Lord and Savior. So again, I would love to have you around. Thank you for watching.